Well, welcome to week uh, four of the small group study eight. And this week for this instructional video, we're looking at the habit of dream. Now, what I really want to point your attention to is the enslaved time for this week's meeting. This is the only thing that I'm really going to talk about in this video. As you can see on page 24, uh, you're asked to download and print out a dream maker tool. Now, this is really for the leader or co-leaders uh, to work on together. It mentions that um, upon completion of this dream maker tool, that you as the leader or again you and your co-leader would present this dream to your small group meeting the next week. I would probably suggest um, taking a couple weeks to work on this dream, ma dream maker tool. You know, this is your fourth meeting for, for the study eight. Uh, you know, maybe it's time to take a little break. And so you have a meeting next week, that would be great, but maybe just make it like a fellowship time. You're just getting together, you're going out for dinner, you're doing coffee, um, whatever it may be. Maybe just take a little break from the study material. So back to this enslaved time for week four. This is probably um, the, the area of the study that I'm, I'm most excited for you as a grace group leader. And the reason being is if you look in that enslaved time where this has been the time where the group has been praying for one another, for this meeting, the group is praying solely for you as the leader and your co-leader. Now I gotta mention, um, in my group experience when we went through the study, um, I had, I, I've had people, you know, privileged to have people in my life uh, lay hands on me, uh, and praying for me personally, and it's been incredible. Um, it's happened a few times in my life. For my co-leader, he had never had that happen with him. The two of us were, were, were sitting in chairs, kind of with our group members surrounding us, with hands laid over for us, praying these incredibly sincere, caring prayers for us. And I, it was moving for me, but man, for my co-leader, who this is, he has never experienced something like this, it was definitely a, a spiritual mountaintop high moment for his, for his walk. And uh, I was so excited for him to go through that experience. And so I'm really stressing for you grace group leaders, don't let this uh, enslaved time get cut short. Make sure you take advantage of this opportunity for your grace group members to pray for you because you just don't want to miss it. It's just really incredible. And um, I think you just will see it as an incredible, incredibly spiritual gift you'd be receiving from God that you'd be receiving from your fellow members in the body of Christ. So please don't miss it. Again, that's all I want to leave with you for this week in this instructional video. Many blessings on the week four. Many blessings on you and your co-leader being prayed for at this week's meeting.